good morning children welcome to my class so in your maths uh, class one we are going to do today page 104 okay we are going to do page 104 please take out all right so you see first of all we are going to uh, study about the days of the week what are they so monday tuesday wednesday thursday friday saturday and sunday these are the seven days of a week okay all right now you see here nine o'clock today we are going to study about the clock all right nine o'clock time to go to sleep it is written here so at nine usually small children they go to sleep early so nine o'clock they go to sleep all right look at the clock you please see here a clock is drawn on page number 104 okay so let us write down here this is page 104 all right okay a clock is drawn you see here now you see look at the clock you can see the clock numbers are written here there are 12 numbers there are how many numbers in a clock how many numbers are there in a clock let us do this how many numbers are there in a clock how many numbers are there numbers are there in a clock so there are 12 numbers in a clock you have to write down the answer yourself okay there are 12 numbers in a clock all right okay then there are two hands of the clock how many hands are there of a clock all right how many hands are there hands are there of a clock of a clock so there are two hands of a clock all right there are two hands of a clock you have to write the answer yourself the small hand shows the hours okay what does the small hand show what does the what does the small hand show the small hand shows the hours all right the small hand shows the hours okay the big hand shows the minutes what does the big hand show what does the big hand show what does the big hand show so the big hand shows the minutes all right all of you have clock in your home so you can see the clock and uh, you can see the numbers are there you can see the small hand is there the big hand is there all right okay so once again let us see how many numbers are there in a clock there are 12 numbers in a clock all right how many hands are there of a clock there are two hands of a clock you see a clock a uh, big hand is there and one small hand is there when the big okay now you see what does the small hand show the small hand show the hours one hour two hours three hours four hours so the small hand show the hours all right okay now you uh, see here what does the big hand show the big hand shows the minutes big hand it goes from like uh, from 1 to 2 to 3 to 4 so from 1 to 2 means 5 minutes 2 to 3 means uh, from uh, 1 it is from 12 to 1 it is 5 minutes okay from 1 to 2 when it goes that means from 12 to 2 if you count it is 10 minutes from 12 to 3 if you count it is 15 minutes all right so you see here the big hand shows the minutes that is the minute hand the big hand is the minute hand the small hand is the hour hand you have to keep in mind when the big hand is on 12 and the small hand is on any number we did the clock by the hours now in this class you have to learn where is the small hand and where is the big hand where is the big hand you see here if the big hand is on 12 and the small hand hand is on any number from 1 to 12 that you have to you can say the time suppose the small hand is on uh, 1 and the big hand is on 12 so it is 1 o'clock small hand is on 2 and the big hand is on uh, 12 
so it is 2 o'clock in this way you can easily say the time all right now you see here see the picture 3 o'clock it is already written 3 o'clock next one is 6 o'clock please do it uh, in the book itself okay 3 o'clock then 6 o'clock second one third one is 4 o'clock fourth one is 7 o'clock next one is fifth one is 8 o'clock then you see sixth one is 10 o'clock seventh one is 1 o'clock and eighth one is 5 o'clock you have to see where is the small hand and where is the big hand big hand is on 12 okay and the small hand you see you can easily say the time in this way you read a clock okay you in this way you can see the time all right okay children please do this in the book itself thank you